what would you do without GPS coverage? Use a map, of course. Do you know what unknown means? In the past, there were places that were not on maps. On the surface of the Earth, there are no unknown places left because maps have gone through them. A map is the communication method used by humans to describe the lay of the land. The dimensions of the content of a map are expressed by the scale, which relates the distances measured on the map with their real dimensions. On a 1 to 25,000 scale map, each millimetre shown on the map equals 25 metres on the ground. A football pitch will be represented on paper as a rectangle 4 millimetres long by 2 millimetres wide. The position of any object on Earth is defined by coordinates. With a visible grid of abscissas and ordinates on the frame of the map that allows any given element to be shown. The third dimension, the altitude above sea level, is defined by the contour lines, which are at the intersection of the terrain with parallel planes every 10 or 20 metres in height, depending on the scale. Based on their geometric shape and on the map scale, objects are depicted on maps as areas for large areas, lines, long and narrow elements, points, when their dimensions to scale are equivalent to a point. Labelling, all geographical names included on the map are represented in a font and colour closely related to what they name. Each map sheet of the IGN National Topographic Map has a name and number on its cover, as well as a sketch of the surroundings and its location in Spain. 1,076 sheets are needed to cover Spain at the 1 to 50,000 scale. A mosaic of Spain would occupy the same surface as a 200 square metre house. Man's actions transform the landscape every day and maps must show these changes continuously.